welcome back to my channel. This video is dedicated to a loving memory of Alexis Crawford. She is gone, but she will never be forgotten. The suspect, Jasmine Jones, is in jail until November 22nd. Be careful who you call your friends and be careful who you have in your circle because you never know who could be against you. Here are some of the beautiful photos and the celebration of her life. This past Saturday was her funeral. The family of Alexis Crawford speaks at the funeral and it's one of the saddest moments of the day. I would like to share with you all one of Lacey's last takes with me. On Monday, Alexis takes me, all this is in God's plan, it'll work out for me, praying it will. After this text, I remember acknowledging the strength and the love Lacey's carried in her heart. She refused to live her life with guilt and fear. She put her faith in God. God was her walk through her hard times. So now we should take her lead and lean on God. God will be our guidance through this heartache. She's now living through us, and I'm living for her. Long live Liz. Somehow, some way, God is going to turn this tragedy into triumph in your life. My hope. As the Spirit of God gives me utterance, you all are going to love each other a little bit more. You're going to be kinder to each other. You're going to be nicer to each other. Public tragedies have the potential to do one of two things. They can either drive a family apart or they can pull you together. Let it pull you together. Know this, I'm pulling for you. Athens is pulling for you. America is pulling for you. The whole world is pulling for you. Some of us think that we can't see God in times of death. I beg to differ. I saw over there in Isaiah, he said, in the year that King Uzziah died, I saw the Lord. Right now, somebody needs to see the Lord in the year that Alexis died. You need to see the Lord sitting high on the throne. Rest in peace, Alexis. Rest in peace. 